Hello guys, this is Knut in Norway. Welcome to this uh, small uh, film review of the Vigger's uh, Stirling Engine STV2 model. His uh, second uh, uh, entry model uh, in the STV series. Just like the STV1 model uh, uh, you might have seen my review of uh, this uh, STV2 also comes uh, in a wooden box uh, uh, like you see here uh, with paperwork and uh, all you need uh, uh, this uh, model in the box uh, is uh, the last uh, STV2 model uh, ever made uh, or will may be made in the, f in the future, so they are no longer available. This is uh, the last one in the box. It is uh, uh, 
Absolutely fantastic uh, little model uh, to look at uh, this um, uh, uh, the TV one model is uh, a bit less uh, machined and a bit less uh, uh, surface uh, and, uh, and a little bit different in construction also uh, this uh, this uh, this TV two model is a little bit more complex uh, in the making. Uh, uh, it is also uh, quite a bit more efficient uh, due to the firehouse uh, that uh, uh, isolate the heat and uh, and uh, the effect on the cylinder. Uh, and the machine as a, as a machine it uh, is uh, very noticeable um, uh, I, I don't know if you have seen the uh, Stevie 1 but uh, this Stevie 2 model has uh, has also polished uh, spokes uh, on the flywheel uh, and the entire flywheel is, uh, is uh, is uh, gilded uh, also on the TV one, but uh, in uh, <coughs> in lesser uh, finish. Uh, this one here is uh, well, it's perfect, really. I can't. Uh, I have had this model for uh, soon to be three years, and it uh, looks like it was made uh, yesterday, uh, and, uh, and it runs that way also. Um, it has a little nicer burner than on the Vigors uh, TV1 model. This uh, here is a here uh, is a handle on it uh, with a little bit of uh, wood. Uh, uh, you can uh, lift the burner in uh, uh, same size of burner, but uh, the run time on the engine is a little bit longer than on the TV1. Um, <clears throat> like I said, uh, this is a three-year-old model, uh, and it uh, it does not uh, deteriorate any. Uh, there is nothing that happens mechanically that shouldn't happen uh, with use. Uh, it has seen quite a lot of uh, runtime this engine, but it's uh, completely, completely uh, as it was uh, when I got it, uh, and it was uh, brand new. There isn't any uh, thing that happens uh, that shouldn't, and that is uh, really impressive. And it uh, it tells a little bit about uh, the Vigas uh, models also. Uh, uh, it tells quite a bit actually. But uh, uh, here you go. Uh, there is uh, many fine details uh, on this. Uh, uh, firehouse, uh, it's uh, very shiny and uh, very very nicely machined, uh, and uh, some uh, attention to detail has gone into uh, uh, making this uh, model a uh, uh, very very uh, nice one. Uh, uh, the fact that this is uh, the second. Uh, of the entry models uh, he have made uh, uh, speaks a lot about the rest of the models he uh, have produced over his time. Uh, very sadly, uh, <coughs> Mr. Vigars is uh, in the process of closing uh, entirely down his production, and uh, like I said, the one in the box there. Uh, it is the last one ever made, uh, or will be made. Uh, so uh, the the STB2 you see here, it can no longer be obtained uh, uh, by Wiggers or anywhere else I know of. I have now lit the burner and uh, we can uh, start the engine. It takes only a moment to heat up uh, inside this uh, firebox here. It uh, runs with uh, very much ease. Uh, there isn't any throttle uh, 
control said uh, this uh, runs flat out uh, for the duration of the spiritus. Really beautiful running engine. The fuel was out, and this will slowly come to a halt. Uh, there is a few things you have to do to keep these uh, models uh, in the best condition. First of all, naturally, it, you never touch this metal with your bare hands. Uh, you always wear some sort of uh, protection uh, so that. Uh, you don't have to polish it all the time. Uh, if you do this a little simple thing, you, all you need is a tiny drop of oil in the <coughs> in the axle here. Uh, one uh, seldom time. Uh, you don't do this uh, unless it's necessary, and only uh, in extremely small amounts. Uh, you don't want any oil in the glass cylinder here. Uh, uh, never touch it uh, with your bare hands and uh, treat it uh, with care and uh, as the artwork it is and you will have it uh, for the rest of your life. And then your children will have it for the rest of their. And here you go. Thank you Mr. Vigges for making me this model and for also uh, sending me your last made model of this uh, unique kind. It's uh, a fantastic model. I enjoy very much. Uh, thank you. Thank you for watching everyone. Goodbye for now.